What did you find and what do you think is the mechanism for this impressive benefit? What we found in this long-term update of ABC's G12 is that there is a 37% reduction in the risk of dying uh, for patients who received the adjuvant solidronic acid for three years. The exciting thing about this is that treatment lasted three years only and we are now out at seven years median follow-up and we still see a persisting benefit. What we believe how this works is that very obviously solidronic acid treatment changes the microenvironment in the bone marrow which is uh, the harbor where dormant tumor um, micrometastases will go to a quiescent state in early breast cancer and it obviously makes it more difficult for them to wake up and to respread and cause metastases. So in terms of the seal and soy soil, this, in terms of the seed and soil hypothesis, then this would be making less fertile soil? Absolutely. Or to translate it into a simple way, I'm a surgeon. When I'm on call during the night and I go to bed at 5 a.m. and then, you know, I'm uh, uh, wakening up at uh, 6.30, if there is no coffee around, I might just turn around and uh, continue sleeping. If I find a fruitful in my environment and my wife brings me coffee, then I might actually get up. And I believe that's the same uh, imagination we have to develop about uh, what do quiescent tumor micrometastases do when they try to wake up and the microenvironment is fertile or hostile that will make the difference whether they uh, um, actually are redistributed and cause relapse in our patients.